well Elliot bonfire night isn't until Tuesday but that was an absolute cracking performance how did you feel out there yeah it was good like um, we worked on how we were going to play against them all week and I, I just felt like the boys before the game we just felt really comfortable in the way we were set up and the way we were going to press them and the way we were going to kind of set traps to get the ball back and go on and score which which like I said worked perfectly first half and again I thought the boys saw out the game excellent to be honest the first goal important 15 minutes in just to settle a few of those nerves it's a derby yeah. at the end of the day exactly yeah brilliant goal Matty, Matty Stevens done superb down the left hand side I think he took about four or five players out of the game obviously great awareness in the box from Shep and Jack and Jack again ball in four so delighted to get the first goal and obviously that settles everyone down and settles the crowd down a little bit um, so again so we're just good to get the second goal as well I mean, you had the chance just before with your head. Not quite your strong point, I think you were just No, no, yeah, yeah, you know that's not my strong point. And I was, I got up and, yeah, I was just, I think I scored one header in my career, so I actually headed it too well. But one of them, a um, little bit disappointed with that, to be honest, but delighted to get the goal. You could say it wasn't playing on your mind when you were played free by Ebu, what, what a ball that was and on a no. plate for you. Yeah, exactly, yeah, I know what Ebu's got that ability from, obviously I've only been in here. Um, two, three weeks, but I guess the boy's got a good ability, so I, I knew straight away when we locked eyes he was going to put it over the top. Worked on it in training again on Friday, so um, delighted to score. Well, the gaffer said that he was playing those <laughs> balls yesterday. Is that is that true? Yeah, to be fair, yeah, he was. <laughs> to be, look, look, like I said, it was exactly how we'd done it yesterday, was exactly how it panned out, so yeah, it's a fair play. 2-0 uh, lead turned into half-time, mm -hmm. into the second half. How did you guys feel for that second period? Yeah, look, we, we felt comfortable. I don't think they really bothered us, really, and, um, in terms of like chances, I'd, we knew we knew what we were we were doing tactically. Um, kind of a little bit of a soft goal to concede, making it two one. But um, like I said earlier, the boys saw out the game fantastically. I thought. But it's a young side. Are they showing what they're learning as well? Because Mansfield yeah. conceded those two goals, and it was a draw. Could have easily been the same today. Yeah, exactly. Look, that, that, that's that's what it's all about. And it's not just the young boys. It's it's experienced boys like myself and Millsy and we, we learn from it every day. We, we are, we're still learning every day, so it's just um, it's just a good that we've learned from that Mansfield game. And obviously, it's a massive win here, so we're all delighted. Obviously, brought off towards the end, still getting your match fitness. Are you still feeling yeah. like you're feeling your way into it? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, look, I've, I've been a long time out. Really, I think that's my second start in five months, maybe. But still, like um, I feel okay up to like <laughs> 60, 70 minutes, but I feel my feel myself cramping up a little bit towards the end. But look, that 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 will come and with minutes and keep training as well. Like I had a good week's training last week and I want to have a good week this week and it won't take me long to get back fit. Have you really enjoyed your start, your return to, to Forest Green? Really? Yeah, yeah. Look, I've, no, I've got no, I had no secrets. This just was the club I really wanted to come to. It was just a case of, um, just a case of like trying to get me in really. I was obviously texting Coots and emailing the chairman. So <laughs> look, I just, I, don't, I know what I can do here. I've, I'm comfortable here. My family's comfortable here. So that's a massive, that's a massive thing. And, I just want to come and work as hard as I can and um, chip in with a few goals and assists. Sometimes persistence works. Yeah, it does, yeah. Look, I, I, you know when you see yourself somewhere in, in, a, in a job and anywhere. So I'm comfortable here. And, um, and like I said, I love the fans. It's fans like me, so just keep going. But a great moment for the players, the fans, everyone associated with the club at the final whistle. But it is just that, a moment. It's a long season. Yeah, play. yeah. like I said, we're not, like I said we, we were celebrating with the fans there, but as soon as we got in the dressing room, it was... It was one of them where we just right we go again, um, but look, you work um, work hard all week to get that moment at the end. So we, we obviously enjoyed it at the end, but when we got in the dressing room, it was all calm. On to the next. Well, enjoy the season.